I won't accept it. I won't. I won't! This world needs cruelty! Heartlessness! Nothing more! Is he trying to resurrect himself again? He has to be at his limit already! How stubborn can he be? Maybe it's not possible to defeat him here. After all, this place is filled with souls. Perilica, he's targeting you! Get out of the way! It's okay. You stupid girl! I'll eliminate you from Hinomoto if it's the last thing I do! Mogai. You wish to release all these wandering souls from the sanctuary, don't you? I can't help you eliminate compassion, but I'd love to help you save their souls. Huh? huh? How preposterous! I killed your mother! You must despise me! I know you do! Don't try to hide it! you and your love for Hinamoto too that's stronger than my hate I know if you had people who understood you it'd never have come to this please can we take the right path together now Fuyo. stop stop it don't look at me like that! Perilica! Give up, Mugai. You've already lost. <laughs> Not to our strength, but to Perilica's conviction. But you can rest in peace, because I'll cut down any regrets you have. I... I can hear a voice. Could it be? Father? I heard it too. I think even the soul in my demonic staff is cheering us on. All the souls are crying out. They're telling us to combine our feelings, Fuji. Fuji, save your father. It's like my mom's soul was the one inside Kanzan Musashi. That must be why I connected with it instantly. What's going on? Why are the wandering souls gathering in the demonic sword? This is how strong the emotions can be! Now, Fuji! Pour everyone's feelings into your demonic You got it! I'll cut down this stupid place! The souls are escaping through the rift the demonic sword created! Good job, Fuji! You've saved a bunch of souls! And Mugai won't be able to come back again! It's hard to believe you cut a rift in space itself. This must be Kanzan Musashi's true power. No, I think it's because of the wandering souls. They lent their hopes to Fuji so he could use their strength. So, this is it for me. That was a good move, Fuji. Congratulations on killing your own father. It goes to show my ideals weren't wrong. 
You idiot. Just die already! Talk! <laughs> what? You just cut down your arch nemesis. Why is your curse activating? Don't you understand, Mugai? Fuji didn't use murder's intent to power the sword. He used compassion for his father. He only wanted to stop your rampage. That strike was his way of caring for you. The ultimate act of filial piety. <sighs> Cut that crap out. No one wants to hear your freaking delusions. You don't have to be embarrassed. Your suffering now is proof you care. Sh shut up! More importantly, we need to tend to you quickly. Stay still while I treat you. You still choose empathy. Even though you're suffering from my empathy killer curse. That is stupidity at its finest. Doesn't that remind you of when Fuyo was around? She and Perilica are awfully similar, aren't they? Vexingly so. How ironic that people who clung on to a path I abandoned thwarted my ambitions. I suppose this is how it ends. Instead of throwing it all away, I'll live with the burden I lost to your strength. Ow, come over here. I'll release the souls in your body and ease the pain. Wow, Al feels so light now. Thanks, Grandpa. In a faraway netherworld, there's an art that permits demons to become weapons and regain their original forms afterward. I drew from that. So if you learn it, perhaps Ao and the other infernal treasures might... Grandpa? <laughs> No, Perilica. His soul is too far gone to be saved. Mugai, you used the Empathy Killer curse on yourself, didn't you? You knew that you could only save Ao at the cost of your life. It's not nearly enough to make up for all the evil you did. <laughs> Don't consider it an attempt at redemption. Shogun Yeyasu, you must denounce my deeds. Change Hinomoto for me. I was gonna do that anyway! I'll make the Netherworlds a way better place than they were under your rule. Hardeyasu and I will support you. We'll restore the reputation of the Hinomoto Netherworlds together. Celestia will help out too. We have to turn the infernal treasures back to their original forms. <laughs> I worked so hard, and still compassion survives. How irritating. I finally understand, Mugai. You cursed yourself because you couldn't get rid of your empathy either, huh? Who can say? The defeated must exit graciously. There's no need for further explanation. Farewell, my hated and beloved world. 
May Hinomoto's warriors be honored eternally. Of course he couldn't leave without acting cool. A self-righteous bastard to the very end. Even though you never managed to get rid of your empathy, we'll carry your burden for you. Rest in peace, Father. watching tell your friends too this is for all citizens of Hinomoto the long era of chaos is over a new age begins now and so their long battle at last came to an end Fuji ow Perilica, Yeyasu, C4, Higon, and Suisen etched their names in history as the Seven Warriors of Hinomoto. I did the hard part by keeping watch from the nethership, orchestrating the groundwork, and handling damage control. Pichon had his fair share of complaints. Thank you so, so much for everything. <laughs> that fulfills our contract. I'm pretty glad I don't have to see your face anymore. Perilica paid Fuji his 100 million hell, as stipulated by his contract, and returned to her hometown. And not long after... Aw, 
Thanks for coming to Edo Castle for the grand reopening party. I'm really touched. We are especially thankful to you, C4. We know you must be busy as a celestial ambassador. Of course I'd take time off to see all of you. Celestia Hinamoto relations are at an all-time high. The castle's nice and sparkly. It'll make a great target for when they come crashing out of the sky. Right, Dad? No using it as target practice. I'm serious, Al. I can't handle any more debt. <laughs> are you for real, Fuji? How can you still be in debt? Probability of Fuji not being able to keep up with Ao's growing destruction bill and Higon's food costs? 98%. Ao's my daughter, so it's whatever. But stop making me foot the bill, Master! You're the one that should be paying for mine! Are you telling me to get a job? That's not happening. I'll eat a whole week's worth of food at the party, so cut me some slack. Oh, he gone? Please go easy on me! But you know what? It really does feel lonely without Perlica around. Yeah. Fuji, aren't you itching to get back to the nether ship too? No? I mean, maybe if I get paid, I might consider it. Probability of a certain someone making an entrance on a battleship like that? 100%. Huh. <laughs> What's the saying again? Uh, speak of the devil or something? Sorry! I was so excited about my new ship that I mixed up the gas and brake pedals. Perico? What are you doing here? Time no see, Fuji. I'm here with a business proposal. You see, I founded the Nether Time Support Force. It's an organization that helps those in need. The first place we're rescuing is Hinamoto. We raced over here to help those who've been turned into infernal treasures. Hold up. You're not going to ask for my help, are you? You mean, we're like thunder and lightning. <sighs> you never change, Perlika. I'm not going to help you out of charity, kindness, or the goodness of my heart. I work for money. <laughs> I know. That's why I'll only have you take on requests made by me, for me. Sounds like I can earn a killing from that. I'll fulfill any request you got. All right. Looks like I've got a new job. Time to do my worst. 